Hello Earth citizens! In this video, I will show you a 10-minute routine to do for facial rejuvenation. Your face contains 42 different muscles, and if you think about it, how many of these muscles do you really stretch and work out on a daily basis? The muscles on your face, just like any other muscle in your body, they get tight from stress and lack of movement. So it's very important that we regularly stretch and work, work out the muscles on our face so that they can stay fresh, young, healthy, and vibrant looking. First, sit in a chair. You can sit with your spine straight, or if it's difficult to sit with your spine straight, this one, only this one, you can lean back on a chair and rest comfortably. So either way, it's okay. First, bring your fingers to your face, and let's tap your eye bone. So right here at the base of your eye, we will tap here. Close your eyes. Tap the base of your eye right on the bone. Feel the tapping there. As you tap, relax your whole body as much as you can. Your shoulders, your wrists, fingers, hand. And now tap the side of your eye. <sighs> Make sure you're breathing out. Sometimes if you have tension in that area of your face, you will feel some pain coming up. Breathe out to release pain. And now top, top of your eye socket bone, right at your eyebrows. Tap here. And now bring your fingers to your forehead. Tap your forehead. When you tap, have the intention of tapping into your skin. So beyond the surface layer, tap into the muscles of your face. When you tap, it brings blood to that area. When there's blood on your skin, it creates healthy circulation, which brings oxygen to that part of your body, making it rejuvenated and fresh. Tap all over your forehead. If you have a lot of thoughts, you will have tension in your forehead. Breathe out. All over your forehead. And now temples. Tap your temples. Temples. This is a tender spot for most people. So tap here, exhale. <sighs> and now down to your cheeks. Tap your cheeks. So it's no longer that eye socket bone. It's on your actual cheekbone. Tap your cheekbone, the front part. Front part of your cheeks. Completely relax your face side of your cheeks and here I recommend leaving your jaw slightly open so don't clamp down on your jaw don't tighten your teeth like this leave your mouth slightly open <sighs> tap your cheeks back and forth back and forth <sighs> And now your jaw, that jaw hinge, that jaw joint right there. Tap your jaw joint, leaving your mouth slightly open. <sighs> if you feel tension here, exhale out. Now come down to the bottom part of your cheeks, that hollow spot, 
bottom part of your cheeks. Again, keep your mouth slightly open. Don't clamp down on your jaw. <sighs> you can tap into your gums too. You can feel your teeth here. <sighs> Great, now roll your upper lip. Tap your upper lip. Tap your upper lip. Feel your teeth. Tap deeply into your muscles, not just your skin. And now tap your nose right at the bridge here. When you squeeze here, this is your sinus point. So tap right here on the side where your sunglasses sit when you put your sunglasses on. Tap your nose. And now come down to your jaw. So the jaw bone here, tap your jaw. Don't go down to your chin yet, just your side. Tap your jaw. Leave your mouth slightly open. <sighs> when you tap, as I mentioned before, you are bringing blood to the surface. Bringing blood to the surface, waking up stagnant energy, moving inflammation on your face. Tapping is the fastest way to bring circulation, bring blood, bring energy. When blood comes to your skin, oxygen comes with it. When your skin is oxygenated, it becomes refreshed, rejuvenated. So tap along your jaw. And now down to your chin. Tap your chin. 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 Chin and bottom lip. Chin and bottom lip. Bottom lip. And now point your chin upward and tap the bottom of your neck. Bottom of your chin, bottom of your jaw. Bottom, bottom. With your fingertips, relax your fingers, relax your wrist, tap the bottom. Ah. And now down the front side of your neck. Tap the front side of your neck. Side. Tilt your head to the right side. Tap your left side of your neck. Breathe out. Now other side. Tilt your head to the left side. Tap the right side of your neck. Ah, breathe out. Ah. Great job, stop. Now feel your face, close your eyes, feel your face. Do you feel some tingling in parts of your face? Tingling means energy is circulating. If you're very sensitive, your face might feel a little bit warmer than when you started. All right, now open your eyes. And now we're going to stretch our facial muscles. So when you stretch your facial muscles, you're going to pull your muscles up and down all around. So you see how I'm opening my jaw, twisting, scrunching. Make as funny of a face as you can. Squeeze and open. 
twist move your facial muscles in every direction looks crazy but i promise you this will feel very great afterwards open and close let's do this for one minute squeeze open left right up down side move your facial muscles in every direction especially if the places you can feel some tension stretch the parts of your face you can feel tension 30 seconds Ten seconds. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and stop. Close your eyes. Feel your body. Feel your face. You will feel even more tingling on your face. You will feel more warmth on your face as well. And you can also feel, as a result of stretching your facial muscles, maybe you feel some energy moving down your shoulders, down your arms, down your chest, and down your back. Whatever you feel, you did a great job. Now open your eyes. How does your face feel? Does it feel lighter? Does it feel less inflamed? This is a great exercise to do if you feel some heaviness, puffiness, inflammation on your face. Inflammation means that energy is not circulating. Energy is probably not circulating because you're not making any facial expressions. Maybe you're just kind of like throughout the day. And your, face, your facial muscles, just like any other muscles in your body, they need to be stretched and moved to be free, clear, active, and working well. You did a great job. To experience a full one hour brain education based class, please visit a local Body and Brain Yoga Studio, near you.